that we went to we went to Lowe's and then we went to Home Depot um, Lowe's to go look at the Disney decor but didn't have what we wanted because the salesperson said that the two stuff that like I guess hot items were gone the minute they like put it out they're like gone the next day <sighs> I've been eyeing that lamppost and that temporary Mickey Mouse bush for like the past couple years and I've been wanting to have a Disney themed Christmas but we'll just have to figure it out but it's gonna brainstorm and figure out what we're doing this Christmas I mean we have time but it's always get good to get a head start so anyway I bought a bunch of plants at Home Depot um because I already showed you guys the plants um the Christmas stuff at Home Depot nothing much has changed but did note that we won't be getting any christmas trees this year so you hawaii people if you get real trees you're gonna have to get them up in like i don't know they sell some in helemano up in wahiwa um they have trees there um so they might be busy and then if you wanted a fake tree and you want to get a new one i suggest you try to go early because um they are not getting any shipment from out of state um because i'm gonna assume it's because of covid um that this Christmas we won't be having any real trees and she also said I guess there's some trees on the outer islands maybe we could, that can get shipped in as well if anything but I don't you know I don't know how that is and how that works because I've never actually never heard of the outer islands selling trees here or like shipping trees out to Oahu or something I don't know but maybe I'll look into it but just a heads up if you get a real tree in Hawaii you can't get one if you usually like go to home depot or whatever they won't be getting any shipment this year so get a fake tree like us just convenient less mess but your own downfall is the smell you don't get that christmas tree smell so anyway i'm gonna go eat and show you guys what we got we went we got a bunch of bentos and it looks so good i don't even know what this is but it looks really good and it was the last one so i'm assuming this is pretty good here goes what is salmon a salmon and a piece of chicken so it's like chicken. salmon dynamite or something like that i think with like for the coffee and stuff on top mm-hmm mm. I like a little spice to it. And like tomato, some seaweed, and mishime stuff. Mm. It's good. Fine. Bye. I'm gonna call it a night. Hope you guys had a great Saturday. Um, we ended the night by just like, uh, we went to a different Lowe's. As it said it had so much of decor there but they didn't have it and then i bought a few more fall stuff from there and then we had dinner every tuesdays and then we also went to target and i got a few more haul fall stuff and i actually got some christmas stuff because i didn't see it at the other lows that you know it's closest to us so i just picked it up because i might as well because they were cute and yeah anyway um, thanks for watching and um, see you guys in the next one. Good night.
guys happy Sunday happy vlogtober day 11 we are no I'm good out and about we're gonna get our errands done hello What a game. It just came down literally to the end. Like, they always do that to me, Seahawks. Nonetheless, take the win. We're still undefeated for now. 5 0. Oh. Anyway, dinner time. So, we went to get Vietnamese food. And I've been obsessed. You know, I love cilantro. This is a summer rose. Obviously, they pre make it. So, I love this one. And then their peanut sauce is really good because we always order from work but something about this peanut sauce I don't know it's just it's like different than others and then this is the uh, fish sauce and garlic chicken wings no dear dear friend Rose Austin C here um, she does a lot of cooking videos now. She used to be a vlogger back in the day. But, you know, some life-changing stuff for her and her family within the last couple years. But she does a lot of cooking videos, like, um, or like, you know, uh, like TikTok-ish style, Instagram video style. And she posts on YouTube as well. But anyway, she made this fish sauce, fish sauce and garlic Vietnamese style chicken wings. So I tried her recipe. It was bomb. It was a hit. At, um, we went to a friend's house for it and we made it. They liked it and I wanted to try the real McCoy because I've never tried it and I needed something to base it on. So I'm going to try this one. This looks so good. Mm -hmm. Yep. I think it's pretty good. Very comparable. Very, very much so. Anyway, I'm going to go enjoy dinner. Nice dinner. 
butter and then you saw the garlic bread so i just put butter olive oil fresh garlic and some parsley flakes and yeah it's still warm so i'm gonna let it sit a bit and then you top it off with some of that bacon just like that 